Hi, mom friends. Welcome to Beautifully Imperfect Homeschool, where I talk about all things homeschooling, curriculum, homemaking, and being a mom. So today I'm going to be talking about the curriculum that I chose for my second grader and my kindergartner this year. Um, so uh, first thing I want to point out, I want to show is what I chose to do for our Bible. And that is uh, my brother's keeper, learning to love your siblings God's way. And this is not, this did not come with our actual curriculum. This is put out by Not Consumed Ministries and I have been following them for probably two years now and I've never bought one of their uh, Bible studies. I, I look at posts, I look at uploads, I, I, I'm like, I love all their stuff, but I haven't actually tried it. So I am super excited to be trying this this year. And just before we get into the, to the heart of this video, um, this is, uh, the, um, they have different levels. I have the primary for my kindergartner and the junior for my second grader. And um, each book comes with like stickers and here I can open one and show you real quick. Um, it has the stickers, it comes with um, a little bookmark and it comes with four Bible verse cards that um, goes along with the study. And um, this one is about uh, brotherly love and learning to love your siblings the way that God intended for you to love them. And then for me, I have the parent guide one here and it also has the same stuff in it that the other two have in. I am really looking forward to this. I can do another video um, after we've gone through it and I can uh, tell y'all how much, you know, what we liked about it, if there was anything we didn't like, um, but I will do another video further on that another time. Now, for the part I'm most excited about. Um, I decided to go with Masterbooks curriculum this year and I am so excited. Uh, the reason I chose Masterbooks is because the, the design, it is the layout of the books. It is so simple. It is uh, not teacher intensive. It's very student led. The lessons are short, easy to grasp and I need something like that because um, I am busy. It is a challenge to learn how to juggle my two school age kids with my two toddlers and trying to keep everybody occupied. It can be very challenging. So I needed something that was going to be simple and quick to do. We'll show first what I got for my kindergartner and he is so excited. He's been begging to start school for weeks. Everything he needs is in these two books and I am, I am so excited. They are very thick books. Um, there's the Simply K book, which has um, the, it has your lessons. Um, it tells you lesson nine, day three, and it, life skills, Bible verses, um, and it has uh, activities that go along with the lesson and learning how to write different letters. Um, and before the lesson starts, they've got here, they've got a supply list, things that you'll need for that lesson coming up, what the objectives of the lesson is, a, a memory verse to go with the lesson, and some extended activities if you want to do that. Um, and so, I mean, it's, it's, it's very simple to use. They've got little mazes and um, coloring pages. Uh, basically everything that he's really going to need to prepare him. Um, there's row, row, row your boat for school. And um, he is so excited. And his math book, um, level K. And um, like the others, it's got, at the, here, let me. It's got gorgeous, gorgeous pictures. Um, and even has, uh, I love this because it's got not only the fun cartoon pictures, but it even has like real pictures. And um, in front of each lesson, there's the story that they have to listen to. 
and then an application, an activity to go along with the story. And so, and because the top is, you know, it tells you what you're supposed, what pages, if they're already marked, you don't have to sit and go through the book and figure out, okay, how many pages are we gonna do a day? What are we gonna do? It's marked for you. So that takes a lot of the planning and the stress that goes along with that out, which is great for me. <laughs> um, but um, yes, it's a very simple, easy to use curriculum. It's got materials list in the front. It's got um, suggested daily schedule you can go by in the front of the book. And so all of them, all of them have that. And um, it just, I love it. I love the simplicity. And even for my daughter's second grade um, curriculum, this is her math level two. Um, now you can't always go by the levels uh, for your to match with your grade. Levels do not always match with the grade. Sometimes um, they might be, uh, say for example, a second grade, but they're in level three math, or they might even be in third grade and it's only level two math. It just really depends on your child uh, based on what my daughter has learned um, in the last couple years. Uh, this is pretty much right there with where she's at. So, but again, um, pages are marked at the top, exercise three, you know, in the day, like here's exercise five, day five. Um, and again, it has um, the lesson, like a, here it is, story um, to go along, that's your lesson. And then the exercise that goes along with your lesson and this one does not have a little story in front of each exercise. That one story I think is for like the whole week. And then they've got their exercises laid out that they do each day. Things they go over. Again, the scope and sequence page in the front. Um, course objectives. How to use items as manipulatives here. Um, it has grading here. Um, your assignment, suggested schedule, uh, again, simple to use. And language lessons for a living level two. Um, same, same stuff, I love that. I love how they put that in every single book. Um, so based on your child, how well they're doing with that particular subject, you can speed them up, you can slow them down. Um, and it, you know, you can go at your own pace, but I love that they have those suggestions. But again in here, story, and then the exercises for the different days to go along with that. And I just, I love the pictures. I love how fun it is. Um, filling in the missing words, drawing a picture, which my daughter loves. My, my kids love to draw and color. They love art. Um, and then for the science, I got their God's Design for Life for Beginners. Now this was actually recommended to use for the first grade uh, level. Um, but I wanted to do science and history with both of my, my children together. Um, and this one is something that they can actually both do together. It's easy. Like I'll read and then they fill in, the, they trace the words here, uh, trace the verse, um, color pictures, um, they learn in about plants and animals, uh, drawing which, uh, the picture to the day it was created. Um, and it's just, look at that. Look at those pictures. It's just, I love it. I love it. This is going to be so fun for them. And then for history, for my oldest, for my second grader, I got my story in the world around me. I got one and two because we've not done master books before. I wanted to get both of these because it's recommended to use level one for first grade and level two for second grade. Um, but this is so, the everything in here, it's, um, it's easy, short lessons. I can easily double up to fit both. Um, they've got pretty map and um, here's um, the story. It starts off with, um, uh, my world starts with family and it gives you a little bit about your family and how important they are and then um you have your exercises you have talk time uh what are some reasons god made the family 
who in your life could you be nicer to and why, which that's a great way to start this, especially, and it goes along, this actually goes along with it really well. Um, just trying to build that sibling bond and make them closer and love each other more is so important. Um, and then they have activities, there's color pages. Um, so this, however, is not going to be something that my kindergartner will be able to do everything with his sister. I will probably have him sit and listen to the story, the lesson, and then where she might have to write something down, just have him orally tell me, um, just say it to me. Um, and you know, he can draw the pictures. I can copy color pages here and there throughout for him to do. But, um, just, I am, I am very excited about these and I will do another video, um, after we've gotten started and we've gone through a few weeks um, and I will do another video to update y'all and let you know how it's going. And um, please don't forget to hit that subscribe button and the notification bell. I plan to upload um, a new video every week. Um, some weeks I may do two videos, but um, as of right now, I'm planning to upload one video every week to let y'all know how it's going, what we're doing. Um, I will be doing another video very soon. Um, on um, some book hauls that I've done and I am excited about those because I love books. I love books um, and my kids like books a lot. So um, thanks for listening and um, I will see you guys soon.